Let's look at the scout mission again. And, uh, oh wait, what? Oh. Wait, whoa, whoa, look at this. 260 quests in total. 97 completed quests. Man, we're, only, we're not even halfway done! 70 quests are currently open or available for completion. 13 quests with unclaimed- How? How are there 13 quests with unclaimed- How? I don't- There's surely- That's completed, but we claimed it. There's gotta be something here that I'm missing, because- Oh wow, the dark one's 55% completed? Man, that was fast. Jeez. <laughs> Alright, that's completed, that's completed. I mean, where is this? Black market? I don't think we have enough Promethean for that. Engineer. Uh, I don't think anything here needs to be claimed, right? Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. Uh, need guns? Oh yeah, this guy gives you ammo and stuff. That's pretty cool. But, uh, Xenobiologist? Uh, maybe it counts these ones that are flashing, you know? The repeatable quest, maybe. Oh, whoa, maybe, yeah, um, it's probably counting these? Mail detect. Mail de oh, it's asking, it's looking for the badge. I kinda wanna... I kinda wanna, you know, look up the... Look up the, like, the completion of our thing right now. You know, just to kind of kind of see what it's like. I kind of want to go to the Jane and scan our area again. See what it's like. See if we did any good progress since last time. It's been quite a while, so I'm like, hey, why not, right? Anyways, once we get enough, uh, whoa, what was that? Something Zelda? I just saw something Zelda. Oh, yeah, Zelda Diamond Block? What? That's nifty as heck looking. <laughs> Breaking or placing blocks aboard a Jaded is prohibited. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, all right. And there's a colonial drop computer, so no need that for quite a while. Not until we have uh, more colonies we can set up, so. Whoa, look at the heads on the minimap. Where, since where are those heads 3D? Whoa. Those heads are 3 I have never seen that before. Since when are those heads 3D? Neutral player names. Show player name. What? Okay, I, I guess it showed on the minimap, but it's not showing it here. Huh. That's weird. Look at the minimap. You can see you can see Captain Shitake's head. It's like 3D. Wow, that's weird. Anyways, let's do a scan real quick. I probably should have taken a look at the a look at the graphs before we did that, but uh, whatever, right? Anyways, uh, oh yeah, wow. There's a lot of stuff here. So I assume that's a desert. Uh, by, oh, uh, gauge top. Oh no, these are just gauges. I was about to say like, oh wait, no, no, no. Purification bay. No, okay. I was about to, God, I was about to say, like, I can hover over them and find out which one does what, but, uh, I guess not. Anyways, I'm going to let that thing scan, and, uh, I'll see you guys here in a bit. Hopefully, we have a pretty good portion scan. I'm really excited to see how, how big our thing is. That's, that's what it looks like right now. I'm going to zoom in on it, and I'll wait for it to scan it, and we can see how much it grows here in a second. Oh, man, look at that. It's already grown. Jeez. That's actually pretty impressive. Not bad. I, I, I'd, I'd hate to, i hate to, you know, toot my own horn here, but I'm actually pretty impressed with that. Like, I know it's, it's a small portion of the planet, but like, look at that. It's it's growing. It's it's looking pretty good. Not bad at all. Huh. All right. Well, yeah. Nothing. Uh, nothing else. Is there anything we haven't explored yet besides like these little, like random islands? Oh yeah. There's a volcano. Yeah, we should definitely go explore that volcano. And there's that fancy dancy island there. And down there is the Obsidian Tower Island, there's the Mushroom Island, there's a random island right there, I don't know what's down there, but... Yeah, like, so far, I'm like, it's looking pretty good! Pretty impressed, not joke, not going to joke around here! Alright, well, I suppose we'll just go back, and uh, it's not going to print out anything, I suppose. Yeah, it's not going to print out, it's, it's unimpressed, totally, just 100% unimpressed, it doesn't even care. <laughs> it just does not even care. Alright, well, hopefully here in the future, once we do get enough, uh... You know, like, experience with the thumb craft stuff, we can start turning all those billions of shimmer leaves that we have into usable, uh, whatever those things are called, those plants, ethereal blooms. Oh yeah, we have taint tendrils here that we still need to submit. Grilled eggplant, pure garbage right there, just pure unadulterated garbage. Let's just throw this up. Don't, don't literally throw it up, that sounds disgusting as heck. Anyways, throw these, uh... Random extremities up, and there's some bread that needs to be cooked, there's some eggplant- Yeah, I can straight up eat just raw eggplant, I suppose. Get a little bit of nutrients from these guys, right? Wait, can't I use- Let's go harvest our crops. Let's go harvest our crops. Oh wait, don't eat them. Let's harvest them, don't- <laughs> Don't eat the crops. Let's go- Let's go to the cooking for blockheads thing. And see if we can use any of the- You know, these crops for uh, anything. Of course we can't use cotton balls for anything, of course. That'd be disgusting, it's disgusting cotton mouth or something. Grilled eggplant, primitive bread, toast, steak stock, 
And mushroom stew. And cooked chicken, but we need the grill thing. Hmm. Hunger restored. Yeah, it looks like pork chops is the is the closest thing, but we need an oven. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, I, I definitely do need to go mining. I, I guess we can go back to the cave real quick. Let's go look at the oven. Let's look at the recipe for the oven. Pam, oh wow, Pam's Harvest Craft has an oven? Pretty much the same recipe. Eh, eh. A little bit cheaper on the cooking oven one, but we do need the black stained glass, so we need to go... Uh, no, 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 we have enough. We have enough of that, no problem. We just go to the desert, which we pretty much need to do anyways to go to that one cave that has the iron. And we already have ink sacks. And just get a little bit of sand while we're down there in the desert. But we only need like five things right there and we can get a cooking oven, so... Does a cooking oven need fuel? I don't know if it does. Enable smelting abilities. I don't know if it does. If it does, then eh, it's not that big of a deal. I've seen a lot of coal around. I could just easily go grab that, no problem whatsoever. So let's go. Yeah, let's actually see what is the closest thing to that cave. Is it the is it the forest itself or? Uh, yeah, I guess we can just go to the desert real quick and go to the what's that thing called the desert oasis? Yep, let's go there and travel about this direction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have an infected pig that right there. Trying to kill us, and trying to follow us, and kill us. Oof. All right. Well, the great thing about about what we have going on right now is that we can just double any iron that we mine in our smelter. You know, we can just go throw it in the smelter, get double the iron, no problem whatsoever, and we'll be good to go. And I also fixed the smeltery problem where it only showed like like I don't know, 18 smeltery. Th oh, whoa, apples! I'll be taking that. I'm taking you. I'll be taking you. Where's that? Where's that cave at? It was like around here. Oh, here it is. But uh, yeah, I fixed that problem with the smelter. It turns out I had a little bit of stone on the inside that I forgot to mine out, so there you go. <laughs> Dumb waffle over here again. Strikes again. All right, where, where is this iron at? Surely it's around here. Like, Oh, there it is right there. Or, well, there's one. I'm pretty sure I saw even more than that, right? Should be more. Anyways, this is way more than enough. This is literally double what we actually need, feathers. Uh, What do we, what do we not need in here? Oh yeah, I forgot that. I need to replant these raspberry bushes. I guess we don't need the leather. I suppose, like, right? Uh, we need the ethereal blooms, of course. We need to get rid of that. And, yeah, let's just go mine a little bit more iron. Oh, whoa. I guess, yeah, this just, like, splits off. Hopefully I can find a little bit more of that Uron down here, as I like to call it. Uron. Never called it that before, but hey, what are you going to do, right? <laughs> Alright, we have a... What is that? A, is that a... Is that a, a shiny crystal? Maybe. I don't know. God, can I, like, get rid of this stuff? Can I use these raw scallions? I can, nice. <laughs> Alright. I actually had some scallions in my meal last night. They're pretty delicious. Alright, we'll get rid of those. There we go. Bone meal. God, I didn't even use the bone meal today. Why'd I even do that? <laughs> any iron around here that needs me? I'm not seeing any. Not seeing any anywhere. A little bit of salt that I could use for uh, Pam Sars grass, but a little bit of coal that could be used for fuelification if need be. And other than that, whole lot of nothing around here. There's a little bit of, a little bit of emeralds. Did I see, I'm pretty sure I saw even more iron down here, right? Coal. But no iron. Huh. Really sure I saw, I, I, I must be going crazy or something. I don't know. There you go, there's a torch. But either way, we have enough iron for the, for the smeltery. We just need to go back to the desert, which we need to go to anyways to, you know, teleport back. And get ourselves a little bit of a little bit of sand. Might as well, right? Easy piece of no problem. We just need to get like rid of one piece of sand and then mine the side of the block. Cause that is if we mine the side of the block, there's no taint there, so it's easy peasy, no problem to mine. Oh, there's yeah, there's iron right there. Whew. I would go to revenue. Kinda like this. Yeah, look at that, just mine that, no problem. Any more extra iron just hiding behind this? I don't think so. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. <sighs> well, Either way, let's see how much we have. Six? Wait, what? Did I get five earlier? I thought I got five. Whatever. Either way, we're up to 12 now. Way more than we actually need, but hey. Getting started on that iron deposit that we got going on. Anyways, let's keep heading back. There's that iron that we originally saw. Let's keep going. Let's go back. And let's go to the desert. Let's go get ourselves some sand. And uh, I don't know. I, I really do need to go mining off camera on my own. Man, I'm dying hardcore. Jeez. Everything's just, everything's just killing me over here. Getting you out of the way, there you go. Hey, look at that, there's like normal sheep here. I'm gonna kill you for some mutton chops. Killing you, there we go. And no, oh, hey, that one actually dropped mutton. I was about to say, like, hey, I didn't even get anything from you. Cheap little sheep. Well, that rhymed. Man, I'm, I'm such a good rhymer. 
Ah, fish and rod. Yeah, I can make another one, no problem. Let's get rid of that. How do we get rid of Did I pick up the mutton? Uh, I'll see. Oh, yeah, there it is right there. Oof, I was about to say, I don't want to get ripped off by not getting any juicy, delicious mutton chops. But I'm glad I got it in the end. All right. Get out of here, pig. This is the final fight. Come on. There you go. Oh, man, there's another pig. That wasn't so final now, was it? Oh, uh, 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 there you go. Got him. All right, let's stay away from his disgusting, awful taint. There you go. Apples, how are those doing? 76 on uh, the nutritional value. Decent, not bad. Let's eat those. There we go. Pretty good stuff. Not enough to get us up to regen stats, so uh, grilled eggplant. Yeah, well, let's eat some more of that. God, corrupted by Taylor. Look at me, I'm dead. God. Uh, and his taint slime came out of my dead body, too, man. That was disgusting as heck. Oof, let's go to bed. Gee, <laughs> what a day. Well, I suppose what we can do now is, uh, you know, throw that stuff into the smeltery. Hopefully we won't need more, more, uh, what is it called? Lava? Yeah, we, it, we, we shouldn't need more lava. I have an absolute ton there. Hasn't even eaten through any of that lava. Anyways, seven iron ore. It's going to get us up to 17, so I'm going to let that smell, and I'll see you guys here in a second. All right, looks like your iron's done. 14 iron, I'll be grabbing you. Oh, whoa. Oh, yeah, yeah, we can just grab one iron block. What am I thinking? <laughs> I was thinking, oh, man, I have to get all that iron just one at a time out of the casting table for the ingot cast. <laughs> but, nope, we only need to get, like, five out of this thing, which is exactly how many we need for the... There's nine right there in that block. Very good. There's three... And we need like two more and we'll be good to go. And one left. And there we go. Okay, so. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, didn't we? Oh, yeah, we didn't get any sand because we died, right? Ooh, ouch. Let's just make sure. Yep, we got all the iron. All right, well, we can just teleport there. No problem. Just teleport to the desert oasis. And because it is just the desert oasis, and it'll just teleport us like right there. Just covered in sand all over the place. So let's just go there real quick. Grab a little bit of sand. We don't need too, too much sand. Oh yeah, there's literally mineable sand like right off the bat. What am I doing? <laughs> I was thinking like, man, I'd probably have to travel out a little bit. Maybe have to break some tainted, uh, tainted sand, but there's literally just fresh, ready to be, to be mined sand like right here at the entrance. All right, well, there you go. A lot of sand. Way more than I actually need. Iron block right there. That's pretty casual. Oh, what can I get rid of? Oh, I, I don't know. I need these eggplants for, for sustenance. So I guess I can get rid of that one grilled eggplant though, right? Let's just eat that real quick. Even though it has like low nu nutritional value. There we go. Oh, whoa, man, I just placed those like so quick. <laughs> right, let's grab all these. And there you go, Tw uh, 30. Yeah, that's a pretty good number. 30 sand ready to be turned. What? Sheep, you better not be trampling my crops. You better stay out there. All right, let's go down here. And we just throw that inside there in that one lonely piece of coal. Anyways, let's get prepared for the ovening, as I like to call it. Even though I've never called anything that before in my life, but whatever. We're going to stick with it, right? <laughs> Anyways, a block of iron right there. That's pretty casual. I like that. I really do. Two glass right there. We need eight glass, so I suppose I'll just sit here for a little while and wait for the, wait for the glass to smell. And I'll see you guys. Whoa, what just happened right there? A feather just appeared in my inventory. What? I don't know what's going on here. Herobrine? I don't know. Maybe Herobrine's haunting my game. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to wait for the glass to smell, and I'll see you guys here in a second. All right, looks like we're going to be waiting on the final countdown for the last piece of uh, glass. Man, I, I, was, I, was, I was so anticlimactic. I couldn't even think of what the name was. Anyways, <laughs> black stain, blobbity blue. Just need to grab a little bit of stone. Oh, wait, we already yeah, yeah, have extra furnaces because I made like a million of them at the beginning of the series. <laughs> Anyways, furnace and iron, and that should get us our cooking for blocks head. Uh, blockhead's oven. So there we go. Now let's go find out if we need fuel for this bad boy. Let's go put it over here. And there we go. And I assume it's gonna... Let's see. Uh, what if we want cooked chicken? What happens? Uh, not eaten recently. Click again to cook. Is it cooking? Oh, it is. Okay, so it looks like, yeah, it does need fuel. Uh, what are all these around here? Is this where I could put extra fuel, maybe? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Look at that. The oven opens. Look at that. The front of it's actually opening there. Can you guys see that? That looks fantastic. I love that. I love that little... Can you, like... See? Oh, yeah, yeah. It even has, like, a little rack for you to put your pork chops on if you're going to be... If you're going to be putting those in the oven, you know? All right. Let's see how much... See how much coal... Yeah, we have a little bit of coal. That's more than enough. Eh. Do I want to use coal, though? Uh, we have oak leaves or uh, oak saplings. And, of course, our free bone meal of the day, wherever that is. Did I just, like, leave it somewhere? 
I don't know where it's wherever. I don't know where it is. There it is right there. If we do need more bone meal, but let's go outside. Let's go cut down an oak tree just pretty casually, I'd say. <laughs> and uh, let's see. Yeah, let's check up on the taint. The taint progression over here. Oh yeah, we have some more ethereal blooms. Keep forgetting about these. So yeah, this taint's getting uh, pushed back right here, which is really, really nice. I like that. And hmm, yeah, uh, yeah, this yeah, it's only like two. Yeah, wait a second. Yeah, it's tainted soil, so I guess I just break those and replace it. Anyways, we have random taint here in the middle, so let's see if we can get rid of the fibers taint. Place down an ethereal bloom there in the middle. Just get rid of all that disgusting taint taroonies. And there you go. Place that there. And pull up. Yeah, I'll place another one there. And we're going to need another one right about here-ish. Good stuff. And then, yeah, look at that. We're already reaching the ravine right here. Hashtag reaching the ravine. So I'm, I'm really liking this progress. Really good stuff. So there you go. Uh, oh, yeah. God, what am I doing? Jeez, I'm getting I get sidetracked so easily. And the people in my Fallout series are calling me sidetracked in that. Man, I get sidetracked in, in this series way more than anything else. All right, well, let's cut down this one. And I guess we just use one more uh, sapling real quick. Because we do have a lot of bone meal. Might as well put it to good use. Is that an MLG? Oh, it is an MLG tree. God. Uh, the thing about these MLG... I, I like that they give me a lot of wood. The only thing is that you have to like go through all this trouble to you know cut it down. Because the wood is like all over. It's not like a straight... It's not like a straight path up like, you know, regular trees. So it's, it's a little bit harder to cut down. And then sometimes it'll be like that where there's like a hidden piece of wood. You think you have the whole tree cut down, but nope. Nope, hidden piece of wood right there. <laughs> Better be expecting those, hater. All right, well, let's go. Let's grab the rest of the rest of the I, I like how this axe is breaking the, uh, the, the, whatever this is called, the leaves. God, how did I not think of that? I like how it's breaking the leaves really, really fast. Uh, yeah, I'm liking that. Not bad. Oh, yeah, we got an apple right there. Nice. Turn those into the, some applesauce, some apple pie, some other really good foods. Really, really interested in seeing what else we can make with apples from the, from the blockheads thing. Also got a comment about the apple pie, speaking of apple pie, uh, that we could probably put in the oven, maybe? I don't know. Like, I assume it's like pumpkin pie where you, you can just craft it in your inventory, no problem, and you can just eat it. You don't have to put it in the furnace or anything like uh, like bread. Yeah, you don't have to put bread in the furnace for vanilla Minecraft. What am I thinking? <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, we have a lot of wood right now, so we can, get some, we can get some charcoal from that, no problem, of course, which is fantastic. We just need to cook the, the wood with the coal that we have. So where's the coal? Uh, where did I put the coal? Oh yeah, I never grabbed it. Man, what am I doing? <laughs> I'm just over here just assuming that I'm doing all these really good things. So one, two, and three, almost four. Do we have enough? Do we have an extra oak over here? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't see any. So we can't quite use the 32 uses out of all of our coal just yet. Hmm. I suppose I can go to that. Yeah, we have another MLG tree over there. I suppose I can cut down a little bit from him. Just, you know, get two more pieces of wood. And then we'll have 32. That's right. 32 pieces of charcoal. Which is going to be absolutely fantastic. For Oh, wow. This is cleaning up really quickly. Man, you can even see it cleaning up there, right? I just saw it cleaning up the blocks. Oh, there it is right there. You saw that? Okay, it's not doing it anymore. <laughs> Anyways, let's head back. Let's go throw these extra two in the furnace, and then we'll have a half stack of charcoal, which is just fantastic. I love getting I love getting charcoal like this. It's basically the same thing as coal. Same the same uses and everything. You use it to smelt stuff has has eight uses just like regular coal. But you get it from trees and you can basically multiply it over and over again. So let's just shift click this and okay, it's just I guess it's oh whoa, whoa, yeah, that goes pretty quickly and it Yeah, it put it, it cooks a bunch of stuff at once. Hey, that's pretty good. Alright, well, Oh, that's the output. Okay. That's pretty good. I like that. Not, oh, whoa, whoa. Look at that. You, you can see it's like red. And then for, oh, yo, for a split second there, you can see the, the chicken and stuff on the actual oven rack there. Man, the attention to detail for this is so cool. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right. Oh, man, I forgot about the raw mutton. Oops. Uh, should I even waste that? Oh, it's already cooking. So, uh, can I put that there? Is this fuel? I assume it's fuel. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if it's fuel or not, but uh, hey, what are you going to do? Well, there you go. Raw mutton. Uh, or cooked mutton. 96. Cooked chicken. I guess I've never eaten cooked chicken. Cooked steak is doing pretty good. And the cooked pork chop is also at 96. Nice. So I guess this doesn't feed into the thing. Maybe these are... I don't know. 
Guess I'll have to do a little bit of research for that. Woven cotton. Whoa. What can I use this stuff for? Oh, leather. Oh, okay, that's stupid. That's nothing. <laughs> All right. Well, we have a pretty good amount of food. I'm, I'm feeling fantastic about the whole cooking for blockheads thing now. Like, it, I, I really should have done it a lot earlier into this series. I do admit. But, uh, hey, I'm like, now we have a fantastic amount of food. So what are you going to do about it, huh? Anyways, I think I'm going to end it right here, and then in the future, we can keep on adventuring on, doing more of these delicious scout missions, and of course, off camera, I need to go mining so bad, as well as, uh, you know, keep on spreading out all of our ethereal blooms, you know, getting this place nice and nice and cleaned up, I'm really do liking. Yeah, look at that, you can definitely see it, like, completely zoomed out, it's a really big chunk of our area here. Nice! Alright, well, in the future, we're definitely going to get ourselves, a uh, hopefully... The 20% of the swamp nice and cleaned up, which is this nasty looking area over here. So uh, pretty soon we're going to get this swamp nice and clean, which is fantastic. And once we get to the edge here, which will be great, we can start moving these ethereal blooms out to here, which is good. So it will definitely save us some ethereal blooms here in the future. But of course, we're always going to need more and more of them as the uh, as the I guess cleansing gets bigger. And of course, you know, sacrifice to the dark one and whatnot. I definitely need to get mining to, to do some more of that stuff. Anyways, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys... Oh man, my pants are gone. My chest plate's almost broken too. Anyways, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. I'll put my latest videos on our YouTube homepage as soon as they come out so you don't miss an episode. But until then, thank you guys all for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more delicious Blightfall, where hopefully we're going to get our kitchen nice and, I, I wouldn't say started, because we already started it, but like, is it, hopefully we get a fridge over here. Is there anything else for cooking for blockheads? I don't think so. Oh yeah, fridge and sink. So what is the sink? Oh yeah, the water for the recipes. So that's what we need for like dough and stuff like that, so... That'll come in handy in the future, and of course the fridge, which will provide contained ingredients to recipes, which will be super duper handy. Anyways, thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time. Oh, bye then. <laughs>